Hi, my name is Bhavik and my group members are Shav, Nikhil and Sham. We are from Homework to Group 15. I am presenting the video for the use of automated tools. The tool we have chosen is Rendoop. Rendoop is a unit test generator for Java. It automatically creates unit tests for our classes in JUnit format. To get started, we first need to download and install Rendoop from their official website. We have to download the .zip file provided. We have to download to it and extract at a desired location. I have extracted Rendoop in our project directory. The rendoop.jar file is the main file which we will be using for generating test cases. For starting with rendoop, we have to first make sure Java and JDK is in our, installed in our system as rendoop runs on Java. We will be testing rendoop on a simple GUI application for the calculator. The application provides us to do simple mathematical operations. Let's say we add two numbers, 8 plus 9. It gives us output as 17. Now, let's start generating unit test cases using rendoop. But before that, we have to make sure that we compile our Java program. This is our compiled Java code. We will be using Rendoop's gentest command. This command provides us features like we can set the time limit. As you can see here, the time limit has been set to 60, which means after 60 seconds, Rendoop stops generating tests. In our application, we will not setting any time limit and let Rendoop generate maximum test cases it can. To the command we have to run from the Rendoop directory, where we have to provide class path for the .jar file and the second path where our main class program is stored. This command took around 6 to 7 minutes to run. And we can see that it generated around 319 test cases. It created two files, regression test 0 and regression test. These files are stored in the Rendoop directory itself. In regression test.java file, it has provided us a suit for running all the test cases in the regression test 0 file. So, as we can see in regression test0.java file, all the 319 cases which have been generated by Rendoop. We have to check if there are any issues or any dependencies that has to be included. In our cases, we had a missing JUnit dependency. So we added JUnit dependency. After that, we can individually run any separate test cases or we can directly run the entire suit. Let's run first an individual test. As you can see, the test case has been passed successfully. Now let's run entire suit. As we can see that all the 319 test cases has been passed. In this way, Rendoop help us in generating all the possible unit test cases. Thus, Rendoop is a helpful automated tool which can provide users to generate unit test cases. That's it for the video. Thank you for your attention and have a good day.